Welcome Bibers, welcome to today's session. So children, today we are going to discuss about that why, how as a community we are coming forward to basically conserve our forest and of course the wildlife. So in today's session we are going to see that why the one Mahatsa being being celebrated in our community and what are the use, what is the characteristic and what do you think it is necessary to celebrate and how it is being celebrated all over our country. So before we start, let me introduce you to myself. I am Anam Khan. I am your biology expert, and we are going to discuss all the amazing sessions related to the biology. So moving forward and starting our session, let's see what we have today. We have that one Mahotsav and its importance. Why, what, why this one Mahotsav is being celebrated, and basically what is the importance of this one Mahotsav? Okay. So let's see, children. What is one Mahotsav? Talking about the one Mahatsav children, you know that what is the condition, what is the current condition of our country is that you know there is a lot of deforestation, there is a lot of natural disaster which are basically creating, which are basically uh, ruining our the forest area, we are removing the forest area for the urbanization due to the human activities and everything. So you watch the forest around you home and feel that you must take an action for it. So you see that condition, you see those forests are being cut, those trees are being cut and the urbanization is taking place. It is going to hamper our climate only, it is going to hamper our earth's surface only. So children, anything which is happening in our country, in our, in our surroundings, we need to take step to basically improve it. So one Mahotsav is nothing but just a step for us or as a community that we want to replenish our environment, our nature. Okay, so what we do exactly in the one Mahotsav? So as the name also suggests, children. So one Mahotsav is a country-wide tree planting ceremony. Yes, it has been celebrated everywhere. That in this, basically, what we do, it is a tree plantation ceremony. Okay, which takes place in the year. There's a particular uh, timeline for that. Is takes place in from the first and the seventh of July. These seven to eight days is a time period in we celebrate this Mahotsav which is called one Mahotsav. In this we do nothing but only try to plant more and more trees in our surroundings, at our home, in our nearby areas. Okay, let's see, let's drag the slider to see the importance of one Mahotsav. So as I drag it, you can see these are the children which are basically planting trees with their mother and the other people are also and this is how we are going to basically this will replenish the plants and the trees which is being cut down by the humans or due to any natural disaster. So we are trying to replenish the trees and the given conditions. So this is what we do in the one Mahatsa by planting more and more trees in our environment. Okay. So children, next we have that one Mahatsa, what it teaches us is the whole uh, criteria of having a one Mahotsav, why it is necessary. So children, the one Mahotsav teaches us that we all have the power to make a change. If it is happening, if it is happening, anything which is destroying our earth, anything which is destroying our habitat, anything which is hampering our conditions to live, we can as a one community will come together and will make a change because even the small, small Changes will add up and will create a big change. Okay, small and minor, any step you take will create a big change. So, one Mahotsav is also something which teaches us that as a community what we can do if we come together. So, children, millions of trees are planted every year during the one Mahotsav to reverse the deforestation. See, I know that this one Mahotsav is being totally said okay to create or to plant more and more trees but I would always ask that we should basically celebrate it all along the year we should try and plant trees always to keep our environment neat and clean of course and to have enough amount of oxygen and shelters for the wildlife also because they are their habitat. So deforestation is of course kind of a situation where we actually removing the forest area for our benefit only, okay, because the urbanization, the whole civilization 
is been expanding throughout. So, urbanization due to the deforestation, it is happening. So, when we do the Van Mahotsav, when we celebrate the Van Mahotsav, we are reversing, we are basically creating a whole new community of trees together or replenishing all those factors which are going to impact the our nature. Okay. So, children, this is what the Van Mahotsav teaches us. So, let's see, let's see what, how we do it. How to plant a tree only? So, there is a shovel, there is water and there is sapling. So, children, I will click on the shovel which will basically, what it does, let moving forward, next we have a question for you that on your left is the thought of a child. What are your thoughts on one Mahatsav and select the correct speech bubble on your right. So, what do you think as a child? What are your thoughts as a child when you think about the one Mahatsav? These are all the species come into our mind that what is the one Mahatsav? One Mahatsav is a waste of time why we should plant trees. One Mahatsav, because it makes me feel like I am helping care environment, you should try it with me. Yes, it destroys the environment. And one Mahatsav is something that other people not us should do. What do you think thought of a child would be? Of course, Yet it draws on one Mahatsav is something that other people not us should do. Yes, this would be the correct answer. That yes, I love one Mahatsav and I would like to plant more and more trees, helping my nature, helping the environment, helping the whole surroundings to have natural, more cleaner air, more neat and natural surroundings. Okay, the festival is good for the environment and ask him to participate. I also ask my friends to participate in such festivals. Next is the question, select the correct image which represents the one Mahotsav. Selecting the correct image which represents the one Mahotsav. This one, this one or this one? Yes, the correct image is this one. Yes, the boy holding a sapling, which is he is going to basically plant it anywhere he wanted to basically celebrate the one Mahatsav. Okay. So, children, the one Mahatsav takes up a place or takes place in the week of 1st of July to 7th of July and basically the message is to plant more and more trees. Okay. So, this is what we have learned about the one Mahatsav. It is a country wide festival, it is a country wide tree planning festival hold during the week of first week of July and millions of trees are planted during this festival which teaches everyone can make a different and everyone is can make a different, a little bit of step would be also can create a big change and it also protects the condition, it also conserve the environment, it also conserve the forest, it also reverse the effect of deforestation in our country also. Okay. So, children, before we end the class, I would like to introduce you to our, the worldwide fund for nature is international organization working to protect our nature globally. So, this is the organization which is working intense internationally to protect our nature. Okay. And then we have our MBIB app. So, children, this is your MBIB app. And we have all the live classes scheduled and the MIB app. So, children, you can log in, you can sign up using your email ID, using your phone number and OTP and password would be generated. And as soon as you land on this page, you can select your own class. Clicking on this, you can select your own board. You can basically go to the next part and select your class. So, belonging to the 8th standard, you can select the 8th class. And you can select your respective language and you land on this page. So, children, it has a home, learn, practice, test. Whichever you want to, whatever you want to do, you can do basically. There are imbibe live classes. They are going to be revision list, timeline, my home. You can learn through whichever possible way you wanted to learn through videos, through different animations, through 3D objects and also from this world's best curated learning content, you can go through all the things, you can practice questions, you can practice concepts and you can also give yourself test. 
so this is a one stop solution for everything you can have a great experience by exploring the mbibe app the next is the this children this is for you only you can download this mbibe lens app from the app store you just don't have to do anything you just have to scan the text and it will take up all the necessary keywords and it will give you the respective 3d images related to that okay so go download it explore the 3d world okay and children you can also join us on the telegram channel so that you never miss an update over there so we always whenever we have such information and everything we share it on the mbibe telegram channel we will meet again for the next session children till then take care keep mbibing bye bye keep mbibing we believe in you